Welcome back to another great mind in electromagnetism. In this episode we will uncover the remarkable biography of an American physicist whose discoveries established the basic principles of electricity. One of these principles is the self-induction, a phenomenon of primary importance in electronic circuits that led to the birth of the electromagnetic relay and the electric telegraph. We are talking about Joseph Henry, a man of immense intellect and curiosity. Joseph Henry was born on the 17th of December 1797 in Albany, New York to Scottish immigrant family. Growing up in a modest family, Henry's parents encouraged his pursuit of education. At the age of 13, he attended the Albany Academy, where his talents began to flourish. It was during this time that he developed a keen interest in both mathematics and science, especially in electricity and magnetism. In 1826, Henry moved to Princeton, where he became a professor of mathematics and natural philosophy at the College of New Jersey. His dedication to teaching and his profound understanding of scientific principles earned him great respect among his students and colleagues. Between 1829 and 1831, Henry conducted experiments with electromagnets and developed the powerful and efficient electromagnet, capable of generating substantial magnetic fields. This invention was pivotal in the development of telegraphy and served as the precursor to electric motors. In 1831, he made a monumental discovery, the electromagnetic self-induction, a principle upon which the electric transformer and generator are based. This groundbreaking revelation laid the foundation for countless future inventions and technological advancements. In 1832, he invented the electric relay. In 1846, he accepted the position of the first secretary of the newly founded Smithsonian Institution in Washington, D.C. during his tenure, which lasted until his death. Henry focused on expanding the institution's scientific research and creating a culture of innovation. Henry's contributions to science extended beyond electromagnetism. In the late 1840s and early 1850s, he conducted extensive research on the nature of electrical resistance, electrical conductivity, and even the behavior of light. His discoveries and experiments left an indelible mark on the scientific community. In his later years, Henry remained a prominent figure in the scientific community, continuing to contribute to various fields, publishing research papers and mentoring aspiring scientists. Henry died on the 13th of May 1878, and was buried in Oak Hill Cemetery in the Georgetown section of Northwest Washington, D.C. Henry's unwavering commitment to knowledge and discovery earned him the respect and admiration of his peers. The SI unit of inductance was named after him in recognition of his contributions. From his humble beginnings in Albany to his groundbreaking discoveries in electromagnetism, Henry's contributions have undoubtedly shaped our modern world. If you find this video informative, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating historical content. This is the Electricity and Magnetism channel, and we'll see you next time.